everybody, this is Lulu and this is little Will and we're going to do a change today and I'm going to show you some new things I got for him. Um, I have been absolutely dying to get some new clothes for him. I've got, I've got a couple of outfits for him which I wore to pieces <laughs> changing him and I was dying to get him into some new things. Actually his mummy Suzanne, former mummy Suzanne, sent me some lovely things. She's such a darling lady. If you haven't watched Suzanne's Babies, please go and look at it and subscribe because she's just the dearest person I know. Suzanne's Babies, the channel is. So today I'm going to change him into this. And this is a little romper, blue romper. I don't know what all the colours are, but I think it's got a lion on it. And it's just so gorgeous. But first of all, I'm going to put his onesie on, his vest on. And I will put your onesie on. Uh, what did I do? Oh, I didn't unsnap the... Um, here we go. Let's unsnap the bottom, silly mummy. Now, um... I've been asked to talk about something by my friend Amanda, who's just the most awesome sourced friend there is in the history of creation. Come here, sweetheart. Mummy's got to put this over your head. I know you hate having this stuff. There we go. There we go. Let's put this over your little head. That's a good boy. Um, I've been asked to talk about something. Reborns and families. Namely, and I've had a lot of people say this to me. I would love to have a reborn, but I'm scared of what my family's going to say. And she asked me yesterday, how did I cope with having a reborn and what did my family think? Now, careful, Will, darling. Up you come. There's a good boy. Most of my family have been really good about it. I've been very lucky. Um, some of them have laughed about it, some of them think it's a bit strange. Um, I've been very lucky in that I haven't had anybody who's been downright nasty about it. I used to get the question, well, don't you think it's time to stop? Every time I had somebody new. What did I do with it? Oh, there it is. Lulu, it's right there under your silly nose, isn't it? What? What am I like, Will? You said, what a silly mummy. Um, let me just put Will into this romper now. Let me put his feet in. Um, but it, it, it's never easy, and especially it's never easy if you're a man, because men do have them too. This is what we don't always remember, you know. Everybody thinks that, that reborn people, or people, let me not generalise here, people tend to think that everybody who has a reborn has to be female, you know, the mummy and the kid thing. It's not true. I have known a few men that love reborns, and they're not just reborn daddies. You know, the mummy has the reborn, and then they come to love them too. Um, I've seen several men who, who want reborns too and I've been talking to somebody recently who is thinking seriously about getting one and he has this exact same problem it's very difficult to advise you have to do what is going to work best for you and, and what you feel comfortable with but there is one thing I always say and I can just say this for myself because I had to make this work for myself. Reborns have brought an enormous, enormous, enormous force for positivity into my life when it was very hopeless. There, sweet boy, don't you look cute in this? And for all the fact that sometimes you will get a rough reaction, and for all the fact that sometimes your family might not approve. I can't say they always will. Ah, your mummy's done a thing again, hasn't she? No, no, we're okay. Um, happiness, hope, joy and positivity are always worth having. 
They are the things that see you through when the walls close in and when you think you don't have anything left. And I'll tell you something else as well. When you're trying to get over a terrible grief, they, for me, they filled up an awful hole that I thought nothing would fill. And no amount of bad reaction from my family could have done anything about, you know, about that. So I, f I found that, you know, I, I really needed to have my reborns then. So yeah, weigh that up against trying to get over what your family will think. And it, you might find that the balance tips in the direction of having reborns. Right, there's Will in his little romper. I can't find what I have done with his boots, but I will find them. He has got other ones if I can't find them. I just want to show you what else he's got real quick. I've got that Americanism from my friend. I've got this little outfit. I'll show you what I'm going to do with that. Right, those are the trousers. I'll show you both sides. Can you see Keely okay? That side and that side. And then, that's the matching t-shirt. Look at the envelope front. You see that? That's cool. Now, I know one is, an, is, a, is um, a sailor set with an anchor on it, and one is a teddy bear set, but I don't know which is which. And then, there is a hat. Here's the hat. Oops. Let me. There we go. And there's the other side. And it's got a nice little um, knotted. I love those knotty hats. There we go. Yeah, I've I've been. Yeah, my family were a bit sort of sceptical at first. Bert, what, what's mummy done with it? Oh, there it is, Bert. Well done. Thank you, darling. And then here's the other one. There are the trousers. Oh, I love those trousers. Look, they're all turned over at the waistband. Aren't they cool? There's the other side. I'm showing you both sides because I don't know which has got the motif on. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. And there's the, the top. I think this one might be the anchor one. I'm not sure. There we go. That's the T-shirt. And... Where's the hat? It's in here somewhere. There we are. There's the hat. It's so cute. <laughs> yeah, I did have some reactions, especially when I wanted to take them out. That was a bit difficult to get over. And, you know, you do have to try not to make people you with uncomfortable. That, I've always given them to that. I don't want to... I always say reborn if you don't hurt anybody. Well, if you make people you are with embarrassed, then you are hurting somebody. That's what I always think. Right, the other thing I have... Oh, where is it? Oh, thanks. Is this... Just look at this little snowsuit from my wheel. Isn't it cute? Should we try and get... Well, it's getting on for a bit long, so I might show you this another day. But look, 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 look. This is just the cutest little snowsuit. Isn't it gorgeous? Um, I'm going to put, I want to put Will, Mandy and Angel into snowsuits one day and get a picture of like three bears <laughs> up on the, um, look at the little teddy ears, aren't they cute? Um, up, on the, on the, up on the Facebook page. And I got all this, all these clothes from Baby Prem com which i will put a link to on the description down below so there we are that is enough of you look so cute sweet boy i can't kiss you because i've got bright lipstick on and you got like getting bright lipstick on your face sweet and i've conditioned his hair it's as unruly as ever i cannot keep this boy's hair tidy it's hopeless so anyway that's enough of little will for now he just looks as cute as all get out don't you i don't know what i've done with your boots darling anyway see you um, later, I will be back again very soon. In the meantime, I hope you're all having a lovely day. Bye-bye. <laughs>